All right, guys, so we're on day two of this daily workout at home. Um, I'm figuring I'm going to be doing it around five or six in the evening every night. Um, just so that I have the morning to do whatever and relax and be lazy because that's part of what I like doing on my days off. So today we're going to be doing from the Crunch Live workout on the Crunch app. And we're actually going to be doing a workout from there. We have a little buddy joining us as well. Um, so we're going to have him in on the fun today. I just got to get logged into my app. Lucky move. Move. <laughs> Excuse me as his ass is in my way. He's getting his Spider-Man toy. I thought I did have myself logged in this morning from here, but I guess not. So I got to re-log in. And get set up. I hope all you guys are surviving this. It is what seems like day 1000 and I'm already going bonkers. Um, so I don't know how much longer I can be closed in the house. Because I can't do it. I'm too claustrophobic, it's boring, I can't do it. Alright. Alright, so, um, we're gonna be doing Ab Attack from the Crunch Live, um, crunch workout from the app which is only 14 minutes and then we're going to be doing absolution which is going to be a little bit longer so I'm going to get a little bit of more space here so like I said the first one is ab attack Gonna try. Hi, I'm Deborah Sweets, and welcome to Crunch Live. We have a great quick core workout for you today that's going to work the front, sides, and back. This is my friend Crystal. She's going to show you some modifications for your workout, and the lovely Adiana will be showing you the workout that you need. Choose the one that works for you. All right, ladies, we ready? So. All right, so we're going to start on our backs today. All right, so. So I'm what I'm going to do is I'm have the video set up to for me to follow them and then you guys will just follow me but that's if I can get this to stay up stay propped up at least and I'm knocking stuff down along with it excuse me as I move stuff to try and get both things okay so we're gonna start with Ab attack. Um, my first, <laughs> the first week, this week and next week, that's what all I'm going to be doing. Um, core, abs and core, and a little bit of legs. And then uh, just to ease us in. And then starting next week, hopefully, or the next week, we will work our way to the upper body. All right. So just follow along with me. Uh, we're going, I'm going to be following along with the Crunch Live app, so you'll just be following me. Oh, i got to get my watch set, too. Uh -huh. All right. 
So, I'm just going to follow along with her, and we're going to get started. Ah, setting yourself up. Right, just be in a nice kind of engaged position in the lower core here. I want you to focus on really pressing your lower back into the mat the entire time. You're going to take your front right. arm long and your back leg straight. Okay, so start to engage that core. Like We're going to start slow, reaching the hand to the toe. Ah! So with a nice open position. All right, and hold on. Here we go. And exhale. And All right, so as my shit is falling down... I have to figure out a way to prop this up now, since everything is just falling down. <laughs> Come on now. All right. All right. Now I think I got this. As we rearrange ourselves, let's get back into it. We're going to, as she said, lay on our back, have our left leg straight out, and have our right leg up. Ah. So, if you want to keep that leg a little higher, you may. Exhale up. Good. Let's do Two more slow. And inhale. All right. We're going to take this a little faster. Singles. Here we go. And exhale. Inhale. Notice that chin is nice and open. Four more. Good. Three. And two. Keep that back down. We're going to bend the elbow to knee right here. Squeeze it. Seven. Exhale. Inhale. Nice and open. All right, three more here. We're gonna slow it down. We're gonna alternate lengthen the leg, reach it up, slow, reach, and twist. Good, a little faster. Here we go, and eight, seven. Good, high as you can with those shoulders. Four more. Keep your legs straight too. And three, and two. Let's slow it down, other side. So you're gonna take the back arm to the front foot, and up, and down. Two more, slow, and down. One more. Good, singles, here we go. And up, exhale, and inhale. Nice and tall. Keep One your back more. flat on the mat or rug, whatever you're using. Bend the elbow to knee here. Four, eight. Good. Remember, it's not about that elbow reaching. Lift from the top of the core. And three. Good. We're going to slow it down again. Twist and reach slow for four and three. All right, ladies, we're going to take it up a little faster. Single. Here we go. And eight. Seven. Exhale, inhale, breathe. Great job, a little higher for four, three. If it helps to keep two. your hands here. All right, we're gonna hold both legs up right here. Hold it up. Woo. Take the hands down by the sides of the hips. We're gonna flex the feet, draw that core in. We're gonna slowly lower it down halfway. And up. Again. Now again, you might not even go all halfway down. Again, down. And up. Good, down. Again, focus on that lower back. You should start slow. to feel it. And up. I know right, that I'm starting to break here. So take now. Two counts down and up. So it goes down for two. Good. Heels to heaven. Two counts. Up and down. Let's do that again. So down for two. And up. Again. Two heels up. We're going to cut that in half singles. Here we go. And out. In. Heels up. Beautiful. Watch that neck. No tension. Again. In. One more time. Hold the heels to heaven. Take it up. Singles. Eight. Try to be small movements here. Try not to use momentum. Use that lower core. Are you breathing? <laughs> All right. Just check it. Last two. Last one. Great job. Let's take the legs halfway down and just find that lower core. Good. For four. 
three, take it back up. All right, ladies, we're gonna take the hands behind the nape of the neck, shoulders off the mat. We're gonna twist and reach to the toes, nice and high, single counts, and up, up. Beautiful. Oh, I'm starting really to feel strong. like that. Oh, See, no, buddy, I'm really starting to feel it. A little like. higher every time. Um, I'm gonna quickly pause it. A little higher. Um, they, in Crunch Live, they don't take breaks. Um, so we will stop here and there to, um, catch a water break. I am needing it. So I'm gonna pause and we're just gonna get rehydrated so that we can go back into it. For workouts like this, I drink bottled water. And lately, I've been uh, liking the Powerade Power Water um, um, into the tropical flavors. So now we're going to go back into it now that we've uh, rehydrated. Eight. Seven. I'm going to go back to what you we were doing before. All right. Four Reaching. more. Get ready for my favorite part. You know what to do. Let me see those pearly whites. Hold it, smile, both arms up, reach it up. Woo! All right, let it come down. Nice job, ladies. Good, take the knees in. Just for, for a moment, take a full body stretch. Now let's get to that strong back that I mentioned, okay? So you're gonna walk the feet in close to your hips. Float the hands back down by the sides. Think of peeling the vertebrae of the spine off the mat. Rock and roll on the shoulders. You're in a high bridge. Remember, you could stay here if you need to. If you want to go a little further, you're going to march the legs here. So you're coming up. Up. So any variation of these marches is fine. Keep your hips up, too. Nice high hips, really strong back. Good. You should be Beautiful. lifting your hips once and you come back down. And let's take one more each way, ladies. Last two. And last one. Beautiful. Slowly lower it down. All right. It's time for the grand finale. Strong back, strong front, strong sides. It all works together, right guys? All right, so back to that, pushing the lower back into the mat. We're gonna exhale slowly up, real deep crunches. Four, three, two. Inhale, four, three, two. Exhale up. All right, I'm Good. gonna move down just a Let's little bit more so slow, you can ladies. see what we're doing Check it, right imagine now. you have the flattest flat stomach you've ever had in your life. Really draw that tummy in. We're doing Exhale. slow crunches. All right, singles, here we so go up. for eight. And hold exhale. It. Good. So inhale. as you get going here, try not to let one of these happen, right? So you're not looking at the down. thighs, exhale. you're looking at the ceiling when you're not peeking up. over here, exhale. right? Again, up, good. We're gonna slow it down, second set. Here we go for four, three, two. Right, Inhale, four, sure. so three, two. It's gonna work Exhale, four. Let's go right into singles this time. Here we go, and exhale, and inhale, and exhale. Two more. All right, third set, breathe, slow it down. Exhale, four, three, two. Inhale, four, three, two, exhale. When I say exhale, I really mean exhale, right? It's not just a word. Fucking Keep going. Here we go. Slowly, four. Oh my goodness, really contract, nice high shoulders. Two. Ladies, let's hold it here and add a little faster crunch. Pulse it at four, eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Hold and smile. Hold it And up. take it down. Woo, all right. We're gonna combo this with some bridge work, okay? So you can keep the hands up. We're gonna slow the, the hips off your head. the mat. Strong back for four, three, two, inhale down. Now give me a crunch here, slow for two. And we're gonna do that again, same tempo. Bring it up for four, three, two, inhale. Two slow, and up, and down. Cut that in half a little faster. Slowly still, up and down. Crunch it up and down. Looking good. And down. Let's go two more right here. Squeeze it up and down. Nice job. One more time. 
and down. Beautiful. Take it back here. We're going to come prepare for our grand finale. We're going to take bicycle crunches, okay? So you're going to twist it corner to corner. All right, so you can always make this a lot easier by shortening up the bicycle or taking the legs higher. Or you can even take one leg down, okay? So listen to your body. All right, ladies. Good. Up. Twist. All right, like I said, your grand finale. You can stay this tempo. Or we're going to take it a little bit faster. Ladies, you ready? Here we go. And up. 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 Beautiful. Looking good. Up. I think we need eight more for eight, seven, six. Oh my goodness, four. I'm gonna challenge everybody to hold it all in a tiny little ball here. Elbow squeeze, squeeze it up. Beautiful. And breathe a little higher. Last four and three and two and take it back. Nice. Oh, it's my favorite time of the workout. All right. So time now we're moving stretching. on to the next one, and we're going to stretch. ready for a nice recovery, nice stretch. So. <sighs> Let's hug the knees in. Um, now that we've done, we've on, that's literally the video. Um, uh, like I said, it was only a short one. We're going to stretch. Um, I was just using that as a warm-up. Um. Uh, so most of you know that I've been athletic my whole life. I ran cross country and track all my school years. And so the most important part was the warm up and cool down. So that was my warm up or yeah, my warm up. Um, so we're going to do a little bit of stressing, uh, st stretching. Hopefully you're not stressing. Um, but you want to stretch, get loose, because the next one that we're doing, which is absolution, um, they you're gonna be working a little bit more. So, and I would hate to see anyone get injured. So we're just gonna take this time to stretch, get loose. You don't have to follow me. Um, you can do your own stretches if you have your own. Rehydrate too. That is important. I don't need anybody passing out screaming at me because uh, they passed out or something happened to them. So please rehydrate. And excuse me as I go take care of my dog being very needy. My dog has too much energy, more than he or I can deal with. Um. All right, so we're gonna take one more minute to stretch, get loosened up, and we're gonna start with the absolution. And if you aren't already members, these are some of the classes that will be offered at the gym. There's Lancaster location, West York, and of course us East York and Harrisburg. So once we open, and this whole coronavirus thing is over with, you should definitely stop in at the gym. Um, hit zone classes. They are fun, but if you want your ass kicked, those are the classes, so you'll be doing majorly sweating, but it is fun. All right, so now we're going to go to absolution. Ah. And um, even if you are not a member, right now we are offering crunch live um workouts to everyone so um just message me i think i have shared the link too as well so you can click on the link um create an account and then you can start using the crunch live workout even if you're not a member ah 
Jeez. All right, so it's making me log back in. Do not mind the background noise. I have a fiance who is into gaming and is more dramatic than a woman. And believe me when I say that. Maybe one of these days I'll just record him and have you guys see how dramatic he is. All right. So the class that we just did was the ab attack. And now we are going to absolution, which this is going to be a longer class or a longer workout time, but you will start um, feeling it. If you are new to this, you will probably be sore the first couple days to the first week. Um, and then once you keep doing it, you will feel um, less uh, less sore. Um, even after this first week, I encourage you to soak in Epsom salt that really does relax the muscles. Uh, if you're athletic like me, ice bath. Not sure if you would wanna do that. It is obviously what it is, an ice bath. So we're gonna go ahead and get started now with the Hi, I'm Deborah Sweets, and welcome to your Crunch Live Absolution Workout. I'm so excited to get started with you today because I truly believe that a strong core is at the center of every strong body. You might have seen these lovely ladies before in my other workout, Rear Attitude. We're so excited to get your tummy lifted today. And to my right, I have beautiful Crystal, who will be giving you some options for modifications. Take them anytime you need. And to my left is the gorgeous Adiana, and she and I and Crystal, we're going to give you a great workout today. Are you ready to get started? Ladies, yeah. you ready? All right, so, so we're actually gonna start down on your mat today. So we're gonna start in child's pose. I'm gonna sit like this. I'm just gonna set yourself up for what's ahead. Just kind of melt the hips back to the heels. Make right, sure just let your shoulders too. drop down the back. We're gonna walk forward into child's pose. Nice long neck here. We're gonna inhale forward to cobra slow for four, three, Two, really open the heart, exhale, back. Good, hips all the way back. Inhale forward again, slow. Really open the chest and heart. And this is what we did exhale, yesterday, we're just walking. Good, let's do two more nice and slow. Take your time. Good, separate all 10 fingers on the mat, exhale, back. Good, shoulders are down. One more time, slow. When you're going down, you will Just feel let it your day go. Your back. And exhale back. Nice, now you can stay this tempo or a little faster if you like for four, so three, I'm two, gonna go a little faster. Three more. Try to lengthen your exhales and your inhales forward. Ah, one more time. Beautiful. Exhale back, relax down in child's right. pose. Just let your day go. Shake out the head and neck. Draw the core in. You're going to walk forward so to a, a tabletop position. We're going to go into cat cow. Nice and slow. Drop the belly. Open the chin. So this is the cat and cow. And inhale, contract. So this is Again, cow. open. Cat. Again, you can stay slow here or go a little faster. Up and contract. <sighs> Inhale. Just find the separation of the vertebrae. Open up the spine. Let's go four more here. Start to make contact with the mat. Uh, two more. Good, everybody. Let's hold the flat back right here. So stabilize the core. You're going to take the front leg out. Extend the back arm forward, plug the shoulder into the back, watch the neck here, stay nice and long. You can stay here or pulse away. Four, eight, seven. Good. Get strong and breathe in this position. We're going to see it again. Last one. And squeeze it down, relax the palm down. 
Drop the knee. We go right into the other side. Good. Extend through the back leg and front arm. Wash the shoulder. Pulse it when you're ready. Four, eight, seven. Really draw the tummy in. Good. Breathing for four and three. Last two. Beautiful, everybody. Palm down, knee down. Let's settle back to child's pose again. Shake it all out. Good. Just take your front arm and reach it underneath like a little mini thread the needle. Try not to twist too much. You want to actually work the shoulders. Good. Back center. Shake out child's pose. Good. Same thing. Other side. Take the back arm forward. Good. Relax the shoulders. Good. Back center. All right, so now activate your child's pose. Push energy not from all your muscles. Ten knuckles with the Don't fingers. Don't go too far. Start walking forward to a modified it will plank. Hurt. Remember, the anytime muscle, you see a plank today, you can always so modify here, now. okay? When you're ready, you're going to drop the toes and push through the heels. Energy out of the top of the head. Good. Start drawing that core in. Breathe. We're going to exhale back to downward dog. Shift it back. Take your time. Back forward to plank. Draw the core in. Nice long neck. Let's go one more time slow. And back. Beautiful. Shake out the head and neck here. And let the knees drop down. All right. Good. Shake everything out. Walk the hands in. Roll your body up. All right. Hopefully you're a little warmer than you were when we started. We're going to start back in that tabletop position. All right. How are you ladies feeling? Are we ready? All right. So you're going to place the palms under your shoulders. Again, check in that there's not a lot of movement of the pelvis here, okay? We're going to start again with that front leg extended and back arm reaching. We're going to take a little combo today. Pulse so it two times. Out, so it goes. Right pulse, out. pulse, elbow to knee. Again. Good. I know you're looking at the TV or the computer. Wherever you're so looking, your right but try to keep that neck line until we get going. All right. And in. Again. Pulse. Let's go for two more. Exhale. All right. We're going to add on to this. Singles. Elbow to knee for eight. Seven. How are we feeling, ladies? You breathe in. All right. We're starting to get that tummy nice and warm. Four. Three. Now, we're going to slow this down. Let's really deepen that contraction. Slow. Four, three, two, extend out. Let's do that one more time because it felt so good. Good. Extend out. Hold. Really nice. Place the palm down. Now, tuck that same toe behind you. Draw the back knee toward the back elbow. So find that core strength. You're going to thread the foot through like a needle. Go and come to a modified plank. Crystal's going to take her knee down if you need it. We're going to wrap down. And up. Three more. And two more. Beautiful. One more time. Now, first time this workout, we're going to hold and smile like we always do. Right there. Hold and smile. I bet you look gorgeous. Take the top hand down. Knee to back elbow. Find your breath. Find power in the palms and breath. Good. Step the toe back. Drop the knees. Great job. All right. Let's shake that out, ladies. The good news is we have a second side to do. We'll All right. So now we're going to pause let's it. Let's take a break in between. Our and phone. we're going to rehydrate. Because I'm really feeling this. I'm out of shape to no end. So maybe this whole quarantine thing is good for me. Because then I can get my fat self into shape. So go ahead. Recover. I'm going to go let my dog back in. Alright. Um, Alright, so now that... We're going to take one more minute to uh, recover and rehydrate. <gasps> what did I just do? Face 
facing your mat. Bring your back to. All right. I keep messing things up. All right. So now we're gonna go back to it. Position, let's start slow. Front hand, back leg, exhale up. Inhale down, other side, up. Now this is gonna build, so if this is enough for you today, you can continue here, okay? Good. If you'd like to go a little further, we're gonna add a bend of the arm and leg, so it comes So up. this is basically In. what up. us runners call up. Superman. Good, watch the neck here, keep it long. Keep the breath moving. All right, now that's enough. Stay there. Otherwise, both arms up, both legs. Full. Lucky move. Nice and long. Woo! Three more. Really find that length. Let's go for two. Good, ladies. Last one. Now I'm going to ask you to hold that extension. Right here, hold it up. Hold. Good. Flex the heels. We're going to click the heels. Up. Let's take it long. Remember, if you have any shoulder issues, you can always take the hands in. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Take it down. Nice. Right. Tilt the head side. Fold the knees in. And just windshield wipe of those legs. All right, ladies. Are you ready for side B? <laughs> Take the hands close to the ribs. Walk back to your tabletop position. Again, plug the shoulders into the back, right? Watch that they're not up by the ears. You're going to take the back leg out and the front arm forward this time. Really find that length, energy from fingertip to heel. So Two right pulses arm out, contract leg out. Up. 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 Get Exhale, your ass out of the way. Inhale. So we're going to do Good. what we did before. Think of being longer in right the elbow with every to breath. Left knee. And up. And take the hand down anytime you need to modify. Three more. We're going to keep it bouncing. Last two here. I hope you're breathing. <laughs> One more time. Elbow to knee, single counts. Here we go, ladies. And so, eight. here we go. Fire up that core. Six. Nice. Good. Four. Now, faster's not always better, right? So, I'm going to so go slow it down. Side. Contract. Four. Four. Woo! And add that extension out. Find the breath here. One more time. Four, three. Beautiful. And extend. Looking good. Drop the front hand down. Press the toe behind you. Energy through that heel. Draw that knee to the front elbow. Find that core. You got it. Now thread that leg through to the back. Modified side plank. Reach the top arm up. Shoulders down. Let's wrap four times. Exhale. If that wrap is too intense for you, just hold the side plank, okay? Listen to your body. Two more. Woo, boy. One more time. Hold and smile. I can't see you, but I know you're smiling. You better be. Take that top hand down. Take that knee back to the front elbow. Ha. Find that core strength. Tuck the toe. Drop the knees. And let it go. Woo, well deserved. Take a break. All right, ladies, we're gonna move into another plank variation here. So, walk the knees forward. You're gonna take a plank position. We're gonna step through with the front foot to a high lunge. Only four sets. You're stepping through. Now stabilize, woo, and then come back. Good, so you gotta really fire up that lower core. So we're gonna Exhale the body up. Forward. And down. Only one more each side, make them good. And forward. And reach. Good. Down. Nice long neck in between. Last time. And reach. Now hold that plank for me, okay? Fire up that core. Energy through the head. Modify with the knees down anytime. If you want to make this a little more challenging, elbow to knee. So it goes front leg and back. Exhale. Inhale. Smile when it gets hard. I promise it helps. Four more. And three. And it really two. does help when you smile. One more time. Let's hold the breath center here. Inhale. And knees down. Great job. Woo, shake it out one more time. That child's pose is feeling better and better. All right, last thing for this sequence. We're going to come all the way back down to your prone position on the mat here. 
stretch it out. We're going to make an X with your body. Nice long neck here. We're going to spread it out to the corners of your mat. So out for two and in for two. X. Remember, if you have a neck or shoulder issue, you're going to take so the palms under the forehead. Air jump okay. okay. And up. Good. Let's take a little faster here. Up. And down. Four more, you got it. Three. We're gonna hold it one more time, ladies. Hold that one right here, squeeze it. Yes, good, we're gonna take the arms all the way out. Flex the feet again, flex the heels right here. Click, good. Just a little extra booty work for you today. Why not? Good, last eight and seven. Keep smiling. Woo, a little higher if you can with that chest. Last three, last two, and last one. Perfect, take it down. Ah, <laughs> nice job, ladies, shake it out. So, so we're gonna come for some like side walk nice. here. All right, so bring your body to face me. So we're gonna come to a side forearm plank. Listen to your body, modify with crystals modifications anytime you need it. All right, so. This is an intense position for a lot of people, especially if you're not used to it. So do the variation that works for you. We're gonna come all the way up. We're gonna stack the hips. We're gonna lift the arm. And then we're gonna lift and lower the leg. Remember, this is a little more advanced. If that lifting and lowering is too intense for you, you're just gonna hold and breathe. So Good for you four, do this and move your leg up like you were doing yesterday. This is where that smile four. comes in hand. You're gonna keep the foot forward. You can just pulse it do up the, for eight. the side plank. Seven. This might not be a big movement for you, but breathe through it. Four more. Get deep in there really fast, right, ladies? All right, and exhale down. Good. Take the hip down. Fold the knees in. Now, let's stretch out that I inside really said oblique. Foot. Huh. So it was gonna come Beautiful. off. Beautiful. Side V sit variations. Remember, modify with just the knee if you need to. Otherwise, so. you're coming all the way up and down. Good. We're gonna go four slow here. Nice open chest. Exhale. Try to keep the knees together. Use those inner thighs a little faster. Here we go. And eight. Good. Exhale. Nice and tall for four. Three. What do we do on one, ladies? We hold and smile right here. Squeeze it up. Big smile. Good job. Take those knees side. Keep the hips stacked. We're going to open it up here onto your back. So chest to the ceiling, elbows wide. Try to keep the knees in. Slowly crunch it up. Slow. So side And crunch. down. Exhale up and down. Two more slow. Nice. Beautiful. Watch the chin. Keep it nice and open. Singles right here. If you want to make it a little harder, you can extend that top leg. You don't have to though. Exhale. And three. Now you're gonna bring your front elbow to that top knee right here. So it comes twist. Seven. Only six more. Five. Four. I hope you're breathing. Last two. One little breath. Hold it right here. Squeeze it up. Beautiful. Just take a quick twist here. Keep those knees down. Open the side body. Relax, draw the knees into your chest. We're gonna rock right up, whoop, and we're gonna flip onto the other side. All right, the good news is we have two working sides. So let's try the second one. Remember, modify as needed, press that body up, push really deeply into that forearm. Energy through the top hand, shoulders plugged in. Here we go, eight, seven, good, up, all right, we'll be strong and lifted for the rest of our day here. Up and reach. Let's keep that foot in front, pulse it up. Exhale. Woo, baby. All right, good. So a little trick I like to use is starting this on your non-dominant side, okay? So you feel stronger the second time. Let's hold that one right here. Beautiful, take it down. Drop the hips, fold the knees in. Quick little stretch here. All right, side V sit. Same option, single leg or two is up to you. 
Okay, Four so times slow. Exhale. Good. And inhale. There can be a nice fluid motions here. Remember, you want to lengthen the spine. So Keep the chest the side, open. I, I hope you're breathing. No, <laughs> Singles. Here we go. For eight. Exhale. Looking good. Woo! Up. Get ready. You know what time it is. Hold and smile. Woo! Nice job. All right, going to take those knees down. Let's finish off the second side. Crunch it up slow. Exhale. Stack the knees. Good. Exhale. Two more here. Slow. Up. And down. Great job. All right, a little faster. Singles with the leg out for eight and seven and six. Elbows really wide for four and three and two. Elbow to knee. This is it. Last set for eight and seven and six. Woo, let's breathe. Good. Last four and three and two and squeeze, 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 and take that twist. Great job. All right, we're gonna roll ourselves up here for just a minute. That's the first portion of our workout. If you need to take a break, grab a sip of water, do what you need to do, All right. come back and join us. We'll get ready for our back work here. All right? All right, so Ashley said we're gonna take another rehydration break. That was the, I just put my hand in something of my dogs. So rehydrate, and we're gonna take five minute break to rehydrate. It is hot in here. I'm gonna fast forward just to get ready. With an exhale. Ooh, jeez. Welcome back. I hope right. you're feeling refreshed. So, next one. Still, we're gonna rehydrate for a couple, for two more minutes. In all my years of cross country. In track and field training um, my coaches have given me so much advice um, senior year our t-shirts on the back said potential is a thirsty horse it's never been any truer so everyone has potential the beginners the badasses we're all going to get there. I know. There have been times when we run, we ran, we fell, we bled. If there's no blood, no sweat, no tears, there's no gain. So now we're going to go back into the second half. Ah, got to fix my phone too. All right. Now we're going to go Ready back into go. the second half. So what we're going to work on in this section is a lot for your back. So just follow me. focus really a lot on their front of core, but they don't realize that balancing out with a strong back is just as important. Ladies, we're ready to go? Yeah. All right, let's come all the way down to your mat now. So ah, setting yourself up, right, just be in a nice kind of engaged position in the lower core here. I want you to focus on really pressing your lower back into the mat the entire time. You're going to take your front arm long and your lap leg straight. Okay? So, start to engage that core. Uh, I think we already slow, did this. the hand to the toe. Start with a nice open position. Oh, no. right. Here we go. And exhale and inhale. Okay. So, this so is basically if you want to keep that leg a little what higher, we did you may. Exhale with, up. Um, the first Good. video. Two more slow, and inhale. All right, we're gonna take this a little faster. Singles, here we go. And so right exhale. arm to left inhale. leg. Notice that chin is nice and open. Four more. Good, 
good. Three and two. Keep that back down. We're gonna bend the elbow to knee right here. Squeeze it up. Seven. Exhale, inhale. Nice and open. Smile right. when it gets Three hard. More here. We're gonna slow it down. We're gonna alternate length in the leg. Reach it up. Slow. Reach and twist. Good. A little faster. Here we go. And eight. Seven. Good. High as you can with those shoulders. Four more. And three. And two. Let's slow it down. Other side. So you're going to take the back arm to the front foot. And up. And down. Two more. Slow. And down. One more. Good. Singles. Here we go. And up. Exhale and inhale. Nice and tall. Four more. Three. Bend the elbow to knee here. Four, eight. Good. Remember, it's not about that elbow reaching. Lift from the top of the core. And three. Good. We're going to slow it down again. Twist and reach slow. So for four, left elbow, right knee. And three. All right, ladies, we're going to take it up a little faster. Single, here we go. At eight, seven. Exhale, inhale, breathe. Great job, a little higher for four, three, two. All right, we're going to hold both legs up right here. Hold it up. Woo. Take the hands down by the sides of the hips. We're going to flex the feet, draw that core in. We're going to slowly lower it down halfway. And up. Again. Now, again, you might not even go all halfway down. Again. So, down. all right, I'm going to pause it here. And good. They are on mats. I am on a carpet, which is not that much padding. So, um, in cross-country training, we put our hands in a diamond motion, and then we put them at the very lower of our back, and that is our cushion. So, if you are on a hard surface behind your back, and that'll be your cushion. If you're on a mat and you have cushion, then you don't need to do that. You can do it however. Down. Again, focus on that lower so, back. Two more slow. And ow. All right, ladies, we're gonna add on here. So you're gonna take two counts down and up. So it goes down for two. Good, heels to heaven, two counts. Up and down. Let's do that again. So down for two and up. Again, two heels up. We're gonna cut that in half singles. Here we go. And out, in, heels up. Beautiful. Wash that neck, no tension. Again, out, in. One more time. Hold the heels to heaven. Take it up, singles, eight. Try to be small movements here. Try not to use momentum. Use that lower core. Are you breathing? <laughs> you will feel All it. Okay, just check it. Last two, last one, great job. Let's take the legs halfway down and just find that lower core. Good, for four, three, take it back up. All right, ladies, we're gonna take the hands behind the nape of the neck, shoulders off the mat. We're gonna twist and reach to the toes, nice and high, single counts, and up, up. Beautiful. Oh my God. strong. See if you can get the shoulders up a little higher every time. It's so hard. Eight more, a little higher, last eight, seven, you got it, six, all right, two you more, just hold. get ready for my favorite part, you know what to do, let me see those pearly whites, hold and smile, both arms up, reach it up, Woo! all right, let it come down, nice job ladies, good, take your knees in, just for, for a moment, take a full body stretch, now let's get to that strong back that I mentioned, okay? So you're gonna walk the feet in close to your hips, float the hands back down by the sides. Think of peeling the vertebrae of the spine off the mat, rock and roll on the shoulders, you're this gonna is high exactly bridge. What we did Maybe you can stay here if you need to. Video. If you wanna go a little uh, further, you're gonna march the legs abs. here. So you're coming up. Up. Bring your hips so up. So any variation of these marches is fine. So that your back in your <laughs> hips. Nice high hips, really uh -oh. strong back. Good. Beautiful. 
And let's take one more each way, ladies. Last two. And last one. Beautiful. Slowly lower it down. All right. It's time for the grand finale. Strong back, strong front, strong sides. It all works together, right, guys? All right. So back to that pushing the lower back into the mat. We're going to exhale slowly up. Real deep crunches. Four, three, two. Inhale. Four, three, two. Exhale. Up. Good. Let's go two more slow, ladies. Check in. Imagine that you have the flattest flat stomach you've ever had in your life. Really draw that tummy in. Exhale. All right. Singles. Here we go for eight. And exhale. Good. So as you get going here, try not to let one of these happen, right? So you're not looking at the thighs. You're looking at the ceiling when you're not peeking over here, right? Again. Up. Good. We're going to slow it down. Second set. Here we go for four, three, two. Inhale, four, three, two. Exhale, four. Let's go right into singles this time. Here we go. And exhale and inhale and exhale. Two more. All right. Third set. Breathe. Slow it down. Exhale, four, three, two. Inhale, four, three, two. Exhale. When I say exhale, I really mean exhale, right? It's not just a word. Singles. Here we go. Slowly. Four. Oh my goodness. Really contract. Nice high shoulders. Two. Ladies, let's hold it here and add a little faster crunch. Pulse it at four, eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Hold and smile. And take it down. Woo. All right. We're going to combo this with some bridge work, okay? So you can keep the hands up. We're going to slowly lift the hips off the mat. Strong back for four, three, two. Inhale down. Now give me a crunch here slow for two. And we're going to do that again. Same tempo. Bring it up for four, three, two. Inhale. Two slow. Crunch it. And up. Hold. And down. Cut that in half a little faster. Slowly still. Up and down. Crunch it up. And down. Looking good. And down. Let's go two more right here. Squeeze it up. Down. And down. Crunch. Up. Nice job. Down. One more time. And down. Beautiful. Take it back here. We're going to come prepare for our grand finale. We're going to take bicycle crunches, okay? So you're going to twist it corner to corner. So left You can always make this a little right easier by shortening right up the bicycle or taking the legs higher. Or you can even take one leg down, okay? So listen to your body. All right, ladies. Good. And up. Twist. All right, like I said, your grand finale. You can stay this tempo. Or we're going to so take a little bit faster, down. ladies. You ready? Here we go. And up. Now I'm gonna speed it up all the way. Beautiful, looking good. Up. I think we need eight more for eight, seven, Keep six. pushing, smile. Oh my goodness, four. I'm gonna challenge everybody to hold it all in a tiny little ball here. Elbows to knees, squeeze Here's it up. my dog again. Beautiful. And breathe a little higher, last four. Hold it. And three. And two, and take it back. All right. Nice. So that concludes our ab blast and absolution. That is, uh, I have Bill Carroll over me now. That is just two of some of the classes from the Crunch app. So tomorrow is going to be quite a busy day for me. Um, so tomorrow is going to be our rest day. Um, you at least want one day to recover. So tomorrow's going to be our recover day. And then I will see you all back here Saturday. So go shower, clean up, relax. I'll see you tomorrow.